In this video, I am going to share my number one video editing software and shh, it's not Final Cut Pro and it's not Premiere Pro. No, it is Descript, an AI software that is taking over the video editing and is changing the way how you are going to edit. And in this video, I'm gonna show you the five things that I really love about Descript and why it's a must have if you want to edit your videos faster, sound better, and look better. So let me show you how you normally edit videos. Normally you import some media. What you then have to do is you need to look at all your takes that you did with those faceball moments and then cut out the parts that you don't like, remove the silences, and spend a lot of time going through this visual timeline that's fantastic about Descript. Number one, the feature that I really love is that text-based editing. So if you use Descript, it starts with importing a video. Choose the language and the amount of speakers. It's also very useful together with podcast software. When you have several guests, like two guests, you can actually have it identify both of the speakers and it can lower the volume or the noise of the other speaker when one speaker is talking. It will make a transcript of the video with the text-based editing, it transcribed what you said. So if you had a bad start and you were repeating a lot of times, you can go to the last part and then the takes that weren't good, you can just select them, press backspace, and they are gone. So this makes editing so much easier and so much faster. Another part, which was also very tedious about editing visually, is that you would have to cut out the ums and the filler words that you have. That is the second thing that I really like about Descript, which is with just one click of the button, you can select the text, then go to actions and click on remove filler words. So if you have these well or ums, it can remove it automatically. And if you have these silences that you would love to remove, all you need to do is click shorten word gaps, set the amount of time that you want to shrink, and it also automatically does it for you. Can you already see how much time and frustration that would actually save you? Now, the third thing that I actually really love is to enhance the sound. You can use Riverside as a podcast, which already creates good audio, but Descript has the fantastic ability to make bad sound sound good and make good sound sound excellent. And it does it through the feature of studio sound. So if you click here and then on the right studio sound, and it will make your audio sound so much better, so much warmer. Even if you have background noise, it will remove it and it will sound crisp. Just to give you an example, this is my MacBook mic, inbuilt mic, not a fancy mic like I normally use. And these words that you are now hearing, these words actually have the studio sound applied to them. So you can even take average sound and make it a lot better. If you have several guests, you can also use this option ducking and it will make sure that the other person who is not talking, that audio is very low. The only tip I would give you is that sometimes Descript does it a bit too much. So if you do the studio sound here and it's at 100%, tone it a bit down to 80% and then it will sound a lot better. You also have some other options to put a compressor, a limiter, EQ options, or even some reverb. Number four is that you can also add some stock footage. It's also included or audio or sound effects you want to use. It is as simple as just dragging and dropping in Descript. So if you wanted to add some B-roll, some extra images or some sound effects, you can just go here to media and then type in something and then look at the videos, for instance, and then just drag and drop it. You also have some GIFs, images, audios, or sound effects. And the fifth one is that you can also create some short compositions. It's also pretty easy to do it in Descript. So all you need to do is just select the text with which you want to create a clip. Then you click on duplicate to new composition, and then it will create a clip of that specific composition. If you ever want it in a different format, you can also choose here in which format to have it. And then I'm last gonna leave you with some bonus features that I really like. So a useful thing is also the AI features that you have. So for instance, you also have Ask AI. So you can add chapters or markers, you can help it summarize, you can help it suggest a title, create social media posts, create a blog post. So you can just use the AI to do a lot of admin work for you. Another cool thing is that it can also create your AI voice. 
So if you give it enough input with your voice or you upload the video, it can capture that. So in case you ever miss something and you want to add it, adding it as a text, and then the AI voice will make it sound like you and insert it into the video. Pretty cool, right? Now there's plenty of other stuff. I can also talk about the fact that you can add transitions, add effects, and that Descript actually acquired Squadcast so you can do remote recording. But I think I covered the biggest ones. Now you might be wondering like, what do I have to pay for all these features? Here you can see the pricing of Descript, but if you wanna give Descript a spin, you can just check out my link in the description and in the first comment and then try it out for yourself. The limit there is one hour per month. The video resolution export quality is a bit lower, but you will be able to see all the features and just give it a test drive. So with the creator ones, you can add it up to 10 hours per month with the pro 30 hours per month. The added advantage of the pro one is that you can move the filler words and repeated words that you can insert yourself. And there is no limit on the AI voices, the studio sound or the stock footage you can use of Descript. So should you use Descript? I think if you use video, and audio in your content creation process and you want to save up a massive amount of time, make your things look good and sound good, I think Descript is a no-brainer and the best tool out there with a lot of AI features and it's constantly adding more. Now, if you have a podcast, I think that's one other tool besides Descript that is also necessary to make sure you create the best, most professional and awesome podcast episodes. And that tool is Riverside. If you want to know more about how Riverside and Descript can work really well, you might want to check out this next video.